trying to think. <laughs> Time to get to work. Just getting out in the garage, going, getting going is the hardest thing for most people. So, just get out in the gym, start moving, start warming up, come up with the game plan, and then execute. The hardest thing to do is just to get moving. Once you get there, it's easy. Three minutes max calorie row, directly into two minutes max squat cleans at 185, into one minute max bar muscle ups. And your goal is to accumulate 100 reps every, every set. So you're gonna have three minutes rest, and you're gonna do that three times. At the end of the at the end of the one minutes of max muscle ups during that rest period, if you didn't hit 100 reps. For every rep you didn't get, you owe five double presses, with 65 pounds on and they have to be performed during that three minutes of rest. It pays to be a winner. Pays to put out.
hurt, man. That was a freaking good workout. The devil's press is in between, but just like, well, there's no break. Double, <laughs> double this devil's presses. Or oh, dude, wow. five? I would have had, uh, I would have had a hundred at the end. That was uh, really dumb. It was easy to actually keep track of the minutes, but it was actually nice that the rower kept counting for you. Yeah, time. exactly. If it was a little bit, if it was probably, probably 155 actually would have been a better number. And, or, or dropping, dropping the goal. Yeah. I think dropping the goal actually would have been better. You could have actually pushed yeah. for, push for those numbers. Basically, on the first one, where I mean, I dropped like four reps on the calories. I was like, fuck, I missed it on the first one. And I got, you know, four more calories, and I still missed by six. That sucks. <laughs> How was that like? When I was at 67 going to myself from like this, it's gonna be. Extreme endurance. I drink three every day to help keep me strong. After doing it now, uh, we definitely could have made some adjustments for the workout to be, to where we could have pushed a little uh, harder probably in the workout if, if we would have done it to where you actually would have made your goal, like uh, reduce the reps of the goal every, every round. It could have allowed you to push a little harder because you knew that the goal might have been attainable, where the 100 after the first set just the heart rate up and not getting much break because of the devil presses. It was just, it was tough. So yeah, for me, I had to basically just kind of like stay in the fight. I knew I probably wasn't gonna get the goal, but I had to get as high as reps as possible. So I had to stop feeling sorry for myself because there was definitely moments where I was like feeling sorry for myself, which everyone does. So again, you had to be like, hey man, suck it up and go, right? Keep pushing. And then at least you won't have to do as many uh, penalty reps at the end as possible. So. The guy I'm working out with, Dom, he was struggling too. So it's not just you and over here suffering. So suck it up and get going. Keep paying the man. <laughs> and I did. It's a work in progress. Every every time I write something, you know, like I like to test it on myself. So it was really fun. It was a great workout, a great like mental push. Like I said, though, one of the hardest parts for everyone getting into the gym is is just that, just getting into the gym, just going there and getting started. Once you're there, it's easy. Like, you know, you're just, you're having fun, you're having a good time, and even if you don't have the best day, who cares? You got a little bit fitter, right? And that's all that matters. Again, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Subscribe, do it, do the thing that, you know, you're supposed to do. Pay the man.